good morning, happy Thursday, and a Merry Christmas Eve. Welcome to the final edition of the 12 Days of Vlogmas, day 12, and I am just going to share with you not only Christmas Eve, I know traditionally Vlogmas ends on Christmas Eve, but I also want to share a little bit of Christmas Day with you. So Christmas Day and Christmas Eve are going to be paired together in the final edition of Vlogmas, Hope you're okay with that. Um, today, we actually have, we had a little sit down with um, my father-in-law and we're like, okay, what is the list of stuff that needs to happen today? Because there's a lot of stuff that needs to happen in order to get all the stuff done. You, I'm just like, you can come talk to me. Oh, Michael's coming in from something. And um, so we're vacuuming, we're cleaning, we're finalizing errands. I have the traditional Voss family Christmas tree cake to make. For those of you who don't know, Voss is my maiden name. And it's going to be a busy, chaotic, but nice Christmas Eve. And I'm gonna take you along for it. So here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, I have to do a shameless plug for my sister-in-law's boyfriend's shop, Whitetails and Willow. He has made all of these wooden wooden things. These are actually trivets. They are a Christmas gift for my husband's grandmother. He did all of the wood burning. Isn't that beautiful? And he built all these things and stained them. Like talk about some solid handiwork. He makes um, cutting boards and these things. He's got his little MB written in the back here. Like these are gorgeous. These are absolutely gorgeous, and actually the smell of the stain and the wood is reminding me of my childhood because my dad used to make stuff out of wood as well, and they're just absolutely gorgeous. If you're in the market for something like this, I'm going to leave a link to his shop down below because if you need some good, good wooden handiwork, Michael's your guy. He's very, very good at stuff like this, and this is just this is just a small selection of the stuff that he makes, and it's really great. You came out so good, babe. Breakfast this morning is a balanced meal of a 26 grams of protein core power shake and a Jupiter Donuts Boston cream donut because apparently I'm the only one in the house that will eat it. Oh, wait. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not the only one in the house that will eat it, apparently. Well, there we go. Fewer calories for me, I guess. So I am about to embark on the Christmas tradition in my family. That is my grandmother's Nilla Wafer Christmas tree cake. And this is something that usually we make on the 23rd to have on the 24th. But because here in this house, we are not having our big Christmas dinner until Christmas Day, I am making it today because it requires 24 hours to sit overnight. It is the easiest, simplest recipe, and it is so stinking good. So all you need are two boxes of Nilla wafers, one pint of heavy whipping cream, a little bit of vanilla, some Cool Whip. Yes, we're gonna make whipped cream and use Cool Whip. I don't know why, that's what my grandma did. And a little bit of green food coloring. All I am doing right now is going to home make this whipped cream using cold, chilled, must be metal bowl, must be metal beaters that have been in the refrigerator since last night, chilled bowl to make the whipped cream, and then I'm going to actually construct the cake and then we let it sit and we frost it tomorrow. 